man, guys. It looks like we got another My Hero Academia movie trailer. Um, and I gotta say, man, this movie better. And I mean, it better be fucking good. Because what they did to the latest season of My Hero Academia is unforgivable. After that stupid student tournament arc for the stupid assignment between Class 1A and 1B, we were supposed to get my villain, Academia. Instead, we got filler. Now, do not mistaken, the filler we received was great. It was rich. It's what I like to call canon filler, per se. Because it doesn't interrupt the story. Instead, it adds to the story. It flushes out stuff that already happened in the manga. It gives us interactions that we would not be able to see inside the manga. Because, you know, the manga didn't add those interactions. It's about Endeavor's family. You know, the whole situation. Pretty good stuff. But what did it cost? At what cost? At what cost? Ladies and gentlemen. It costed us. My villain, Academia. Because you see, this season is almost over. And yet, they're trying to serve us my villain Academia now. I watched my villain Academia. I liked what's going on. It's pretty fucking badass. Alright? Pretty cool. Was it nutworthy? Nah, it didn't bust. Didn't even throb. Didn't even pulsate. Not once. But it was pretty cool action, you know what I mean? Pretty cool. Couldn't be angry. But there was a portion that fell off to me. If you guys watch My Hero Academia, if you've seen the scene, it was when they were training against... What the hell is his name? The giant dude. I forgot his name. I don't want to say his name wrong. But you know who I'm talking about. Let me find his name real quick. I really want to know his name now. That's what happens. I get so fucking curious. All right. So his name is Gigantomachia. Or is it? Yeah, I think it's Gigantomachia or Giganto. I'm going to say Gigantomachia. That's kind of a, uh, that's a badass name. Gigantomachia. Damn, that's power. Anyway, so yeah, they're all training against Gigantomachia. Basically trying to make him bow down to them. Making this big behemoth, this monster, recognize Shigaraki as his master as he did all for one but as this is happening we don't really get to see the actual training happen we see it but it's being told narratively we're not actually seeing it happen in real time it's showing some of the events but there's narration over it explaining what's going on so in my mind i was like hmm i'm not sure if the, if it was like this in the manga all right I'm not sure, but if it wasn't, yikes. I said to myself, if, if the anime were to fuck up this arc, I think this would be the scene. This would be the scene that would basically brush over past a lot of info. Because that's what it felt like. And lo and behold, I'm not saying that was the scene. I'm not sure. But I heard that they skipped through a lot of shit. Your boy was right. Everyone was right. Studio Bones has failed us. This is... This this is what I'm talking about, man. I try to give anime the benefit of the doubt. And each time, they try to push me into becoming a manga reader. And My, My Hero Academia is a big anime. And for, th and for them to even consider... Pulling a promised Neverland on us. I would have rather had them leave off on a fucking cliffhanger. Or just end the whole season on filler. Than having them skip over anything. And they skipped over shit unfortunately. Oh boy. I gotta read the manga now. I might stick with the manga just to get to the uh. You know. Cause I was spoiled for a few things. And you know. Kinda pissed me off. But I got over it. It's to be expected, I suppose. Um, just deaths. Just people dying. Just one person dying, actually. Only one death. No, no, no. Make that two deaths. And uh, a certain character's identity. Yeah, I got spoiled to all fucking hell, didn't I? Jesus. But other than that... Yeah, that apparently that filler 
was supposed to be building up to this this fucking movie. So if this movie does not measure up to what it's supposed to be. I don't even know, man. I might just give up on the My Hero Academia anime, period. I might just start watching the other shit. Alas, we can only imagine what the future might hold for us. What I do know is what the present holds, and that is the fourth trailer of My Hero Academia Movie 3 World Heroes Mission. Let's check it out. First of all, where are the subtitles at, my friend? English. I'm glad that is not auto-generated, so this is legit. Alright, let's check it. We already know this. Yes. What the fuck is this music, bro? Hold on, hold on, hold on. What the fuck is this music? I'm not trying to be an asshole, but I, I'm just curious. You know what kind of vibes I'm getting? I'm getting a farm vibes. It reminds me of that scene on Endgame when Hulk was riding in the back of that pickup truck. I don't know. It, it, it's just what it reminds me of. Let's let's run it back a little bit. So this is gonna be the victim, all right? Every movie has their victim. Um, <laughs> all right. Maybe not every movie. The first movie had a waifu, but the last movie, the um, the original characters were the victims of the movie. I'm guessing this dude is gonna be the victim of the movie. Using black web. Oh damn. Your hair looks terrible. <laughs> why why is it that you are a terrible person, Deku? Is what they're saying on the previous trailers correct? Hmm? Did you commit mass murder? That's why I want to be cool. That's what some people think, yes. Some of them are actually like that. Let me go back a little bit. Yeah, some heroes are like that. Maybe. Asian Kung Fu Generation? Nani, they're back. This song's gonna be a banger by default. They're doing the thing, aren't they? I gotta go back. Damn. I take back what I said about the song, by the way. Uh, they really, uh... This movie's gonna be fucking dramatic. I mean, the last movie was sort of dramatic. Especially near the end, but this one looks like it's gonna be, uh... A, a, uh, somewhat of a spectacle. The first movie for me was lackluster. The only good thing to come out of that movie was, uh, the, the waifu. That's, that's pretty much it. Second movie did great. I want to see some of the action scenes again. Hold on. What is this red shit? Is this his fire? Looking a little red. Bakugo, what happened to your eye, bro? Bro, oh my god, this dude got the red eye. Someone, oh man, he's gonna get fucked up, huh? Interesting. Of 
cool shit, cool shit. Um, damn. I'm expecting uh, big things from this movie. I'm expecting Deku. Spoiler alert for those of you who have not seen uh, the previous movie. Uh, what was it called? Two Heroes or some shit? Oh, no, Heroes Rising. No, I think it was Heroes Rising. For those of you who haven't seen Heroes Rising, Midoriya gives all for one to Bakugou. I'm guessing he's going to give it to Todoroki as well. Um, one for all on some Sonic fucking 06 shit, some uh, uh, triple Super Saiyan trio type shit from uh, Super Android 13. Uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to that. That's pretty much it, guys, but uh, let's see if this movie sucks, all right? Because if it does, fuck the anime, fuck everything My Hero Academia, and I'm just gonna... I don't know, man. <laughs> Peace.